this time we're going to be talking about the Latin naming system. This is an alternate way to let uh, someone know what is the charge of one of those metal ions where there's more than one possible oxidation state. This is not commonly used anymore. However, we do cover it just to make sure that students, um, if they see it, understand what it means and how to recognize it. So, um, the Latin naming system. There are certain elements whose symbols are derived from their Latin names. Copper, iron, lead, and tin. Now these are, uh, as I said, derived from their Latin names. The Latin name for copper is cuprum, uh, for iron, ferrum, for lead, plumum, and for tin, stanum. So we can see where those symbols come from. Uh, now, earlier you've learned, or previously you've learned, that copper can form either a plus one or a plus two ion. So we need to have a way of indicating this in the name. So that's going to be done with a suffix that lets us know which version of the copper ion are we dealing with. So I'm going to use the beginning of the Latin name cuprum. And then I'm going to indicate uh, the plus one by using a suffix. In this case, it's us. So if I had copper one chloride, that's C-U-C-L, the name for that in the Latin system would be cuprous chloride. Now, copper can also form a plus two ion. Uh, if we have <coughs> copper two chloride, that would be C-U-C-L-2. The Latin name for that would be cupric chloride. Uh, now, I can do this with the other um, elements that are um, part of this Latin naming system. So the iron plus two ion would be ferrous. So ferrous chloride would be FeCl2. If I have the plus three iron ion, that's ferric. So ferric chloride is the same thing as iron three chloride. Uh, for lead, plus two is plumus. The lead plus four ion is plummic. Plumus chloride would also be called lead 2 chloride, that would be PBCl2. Plumic chloride is also lead 4 chloride, that would be PBCl4. Finally, we have tin. Uh, for tin plus 2, that is stannous. Stannous chloride is the same thing as tin 2 chloride, that would be SNCl2. Tin 4 is stannic. So stannic chloride is the same thing as tin-4 chloride. That would have a formula of SNCl4. Uh, final note here, please uh, note that the us ending is always used for the oxidation state, which is the lower charge. The ick ending is always telling us it's the oxidation state with the higher charge.